Twitch is basically the embodiment of a social media platform in its emo phase. And I say this because generally there isn't a lot of spotlight on Twitch, at least compared to YouTube or TikTok. That is until now. I mean, like recently one dude scammed a lot of the top streamers on the site. Bro basically Thanos snapped a bunch of streamers' pockets and got away with it. I mean, that would be equivalent to me getting my cheeks clapped in 4K on stream. Bro, that already happened. Wait, I forgot to turn off my stream while I was getting my cheeks clapped? No, a girl already did that and all she got was a two day ban. Wait, wait, what did you I mean, by now y'all have heard of how unfair Twitch is. Like at this point, Twitch, you're pushing Jim Crow levels of unfairity. Like Twitch, people ain't using your site to game anymore. They using it to get off. The only thing twitching is their meat. In fact, I don't think it's a crazy take to say that Twitch staff is basically the modern day bouncers you see at the club. Mm. Yo, you can enter. Yo, you're good. I don't even need a CID. Hey, hey! Step a foot anywhere near this place and I'm blowing your brains out! I didn't even do anything! Yes, you did! What? You're black! Like, Twitch staff has to be a bunch of down bad simps. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if someone came up to me and told me that they were on some Illuminati timing. Because I believe it. I mean, when a streamer says anything negative about Twitch and a Twitch moderator pops up, they switched up faster than the teacher did when the principal walked into the room. And also, why does it feel like we never get to see the CEO or any of the Twitch higher up? See, this is the CEO of Twitch. Look familiar? Well, check this out. Bro, there's literally no similarities at all. Oh yeah? How about now? Bro, what the fuck? You know, I've been giving Twitch a lot of smoke, but honestly, some of the creators on there deserve some too. People always talk so highly about Twitch culture, but when I think of Twitch culture, all I can think of is hot tub streamers and streamers who will either barely read your donation or just completely ignore it. Yo, thank you Cheat Clapper 11 for the dono. Let me see what you said. Uh, thank you for streaming every day. It really helped me get out of a dark place. My mom passed away recently and I've just Man, that's way too much to read, bro. Hey, chat, do you guys think this guy's a loser? Yo, chat, whoever can roast this guy the best gets 10 bands. In fact, here, let me start it off. His donation really passed away faster than his mom. Hey, 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 he really need to stop worrying about his mom and worry about getting some b Hey, bro, how did you get in my house? Look, return my donation or I'm ending your whole career. Bro, I will really beat you up. I am not scared of you. <laughs> I didn't plan on fighting you. Wait, what? Yo! So, how long should we ban him? Hmm, I mean, he is one of our top streamers, so, uh, I say give him a two-second ban. Some Twitch streamers also have a habit of just turning on a show and sitting there while donations rack up. Like, bro, they really found an infinite money glitch. In fact, if any streamer is watching my video right now just reacting to it, bro, what are you doing? Raid my channel or something, bro. And don't think I'm letting the viewers who stick around for that content slide. I understand if you're doing it to pirate a show, you know, watch it while the streamer is watching it. But other than that scenario, why are you still watching the stream, bro? If I wanted to watch something and have someone to make minor comments every 30 minutes i just watch something with my wife i don't have a wife i just felt like it would you know be funny if like like i don't know like a laugh track played after that or something you know what never mind all this low-key reminds me of the first time i ever did a live stream only thing was i did it on youtube nevertheless though that shit did not go smoothly at all first off i was streaming while playing fortnite off a laptop that obviously couldn't handle it like call me captain yummy because i'm pushing my laptop past its limits like that thing was straight up sounding like a jet in world war 3 bro i'm surprised the whole laptop didn't just explode Dude, please end your stream, bro. I don't think your laptop can handle it. Bro, it'll be good. Don't worry. Plus, I have this extra fan over here to help cool it off. Uh, is this supposed to shake like that? Bro, see, I told you we have nothing to worry about. On top of the laptop having an asthma attack, the stream wasn't even good. When I went back to look at the stream, it straight up looked like a stop motion film. Like, look, here, let me try my best to recreate what the stream looked like. Yo, guys, we just landed in Tilted Towers. We're about to go crazy. Guys, we died. Oh my gosh, we died, bro. Oh my. Oh. Yeah, so honestly, respect to all you streamers out there, man, because I hanged up my green screen early. But hey, man, maybe one day I'll get back into it. But as for now, watch this video on why I hate birthdays, because it's a good video, or else I'll blast your brains out. But anyways, as always, peace out and stay lit.